Have you considered all of your transportation needs? Nyamarizer LLC has developed and designed a solution that will meet any of your towing needs. Our modern day industry demands flexibility, productivity, and efficiency. These demands are clearly visible in everyday tasks that circumvent the transportation industry. It is advisable to purchase a larger trailer with higher gross trailer weight limits than a smaller one that would be less productive and efficient. There are certain limitations that arise from such a decision. Most likely, the gooseneck type trailer will be best suited in terms of gross trailer weight limits since there are specific weight loading restrictions in tongue-drawn trailers. This is due to the hitch, ball, and receiver load limitations, as well as vehicle limitations. A common gooseneck trailer can only be drawn by a fifth wheel or gooseneck adapter equipped vehicle. There is no possibility to tow a gooseneck with a regular deadweight hitch assembly. So should a gooseneck trailer be left behind at a job site with no gooseneck equipped pickup on site to pull it, it will remain there until a proper vehicle is allocated to attach to it. Now, would it not be great and in everybody's desire to adapt a common gooseneck trailer to a regular tongue-drawn trailer with the ease of helping hands? Nyamarizer LLC has developed and designed a universal gooseneck trailer that is capable of being drawn by a regular deadweight hitch or gooseneck hitch equipped vehicle. As displayed in the animation, there are only 40 bolts and nuts that couple the gooseneck adapter to the tongue trailer. The actual adapter only weighs approximately 850 pounds. This means that it's easily detachable. Furthermore, we have designed provisions on the trailer bed itself that are intended for storage of the gooseneck adapter. Why settle for a regular tongue or gooseneck drawn trailer that gives you the advantages of either of the two, but not of both at the same time? This helps conserve raw materials as well as capital instead of purchasing two different types of trailers. As shown by the animation, the design and the development process of this two-in-one trailer was simple. First, a general model was created that would meet the geometrical and dimensional requirements laid out by the design team. Secondly, the geometry was adapted in accordance to structural analysis results. And finally, the weight optimizations were performed on load as well as non-load bearing components to not affect the structural integrity but to increase the payload of the trailer. Why settle for one-in-one one when there's two-in-one? More is always better than less.